We are in Outlook 2016, and I'm going to show you how to change your calendar permissions so you can decide who has access to your calendar and what type of permissions they get. So we're in our calendar, and we're at the Home tab, as you can see. Let's go ahead and click on the Calendar Permissions box. And from here, we see that the default is anybody can see our free busy time. They can see when it is that we're free and when it is that we're busy, but they can't see what it is. And we can see Anonymous is set to None. And we can see that I myself have full access to my own calendar. So let's go ahead and click Add. And we're going to add some various different people. So let's add John. And let's add Mary. And click OK. And let's scroll down. We see John and Mary. And by default, you can see they're only going to be able to see the free busy time, which is our defaults at the top that we see already. So it's not going to give them any more rights until we manually do that. So let's go ahead and click on John. And let's hit the drop down level where it says permission level. And let's say John is now going to be able to be a reviewer. So John can not only see that I have an appointment, but he can see the full details of that appointment. However, John can't make any changes. As you can see, he has no right changes uh, or anything else that allows him to make changes. Cannot delete anything either. Let's go to Mary, and let's give Mary a little bit more access. Let's go ahead and say Mary is going to be an editor. So an editor will give her, again, full details. She can delete items. She can also create items and edit any items. She cannot create subfolders, however. And of course, the folder is visible to her. She's not showing up as the contact or the owner. Although if I change that to owner, you can see that now all the boxes are checked and she now has full access. Let's go ahead and click Apply. And now from Mary or John's mailbox in their Outlook, they can now open and give have the rights that we gave them earlier to my mailbox calendar. Go ahead and click OK when done.